Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back. Now the next level in the golden mask is Fool's Gold. So right off the bat we will get ambushed by a guy with a shotgun. He's gonna spawn up there. And he missed me, nice. Now there's also a dog in the next room in front of us. Now wait for the guy with a shotgun. There's a guy with a shotgun in that room as well. There's a guy with a bat. And now let's wait for the second guy with a shotgun. Now we will open this door by pulling this lever over here. This lever also spawns a flamethrower guy. So let's go lay waste to him. Over here to the right, we will spawn one dog. Standing on this tile where the shotgun shells are will spawn another flamethrower guy. And he should drop a small med pack. Now here we have to pull out this box. That box was hiding M16 clips. And now we can pull this box. Because behind it, there are some gold coins.
there's also a guy with a shotgun behind the guy with the bat. And this guy shot me, which is fine. The guy with a bat drops a small med pack. Now over here, I like to equip the M16 and stand here, shoot the guy on the top. Then go here and shoot that guy in the back. Deal with this dog. Then deal with this dog. And now with all of them dead, uh -huh. we can loot some stuff. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The shotgun shells were here. Now jumping up here, we'll spawn a guy with a bat and some eagles. Coming here will spawn a guy with a bat. Now this slope takes us where we killed the dog and got the M16 clip. And this slope takes us down where we killed a guy with a bat and a guy with a shotgun. So we don't have to use any slope. And the way we want to go is this way. Here to the left we can't go just yet because we are missing a circuit board. Now coming here we'll spawn a guy with a shotgun. Inside here, we will spawn a dog. Uh -huh. 
And now here I have to save because this next part is kind of the hardest part of the level. Especially if you are doing a nomad pack run. Because here we get to spawn a snowmobile guy. So I like to spawn him and then run back and wait to ambush him. And then just run behind him and shoot him. There should also be three rats in this room. Taking this key card will spawn a guy with a bat. And he will come all the way here to attack us. Now where is that one more rat? There he is. With him out of the way. Let's get the guy with a bat. Okay, now standing on that tile above Lara's head will spawn a snowmobile guy. But if we push out this box, then we will spawn two snowmobile guys. You can fight one of them at a time, but I like to get rid of them both and just not worry about them anymore and also the second snowmobile guy he needs more time than the first one to get to you so by the time we are done with the first snowmobile guy we will be ready for the next one when he comes and joins the fight now i'm gonna take out my shotgun to get rid of the first guy as fast as possible because the second guy is coming as well And I'm gonna take out the second guy with Uzis. And that's it. All three of them are down and that was basically the hardest part of the level if you're doing a Nomad Pack run. Now over here, there's a guy behind that pillar with a shotgun.
it looks like he died. So now we can go down. Standing on this tile will spawn a flamethrower guy. And now we can go up. <laughs> now there's a door here. And there's a door behind this box. <laughs> Picking up the grenade rounds opens this door and then picking up these opens another door. And here we get a grenade launcher. Now the road to the right leads back here. So we have to go to the left. Standing here, this is not a secret, but this opens a door that leads to a secret. And this is the door that just opened.
picking this up spawns a guy with a bat. Now, we don't have the card for this, but pulling this will spawn a guy with a shotgun behind us. Uh -huh. And he drops the red star key card. Coming here will close the door behind us. So we can't go back to get the secret or whatever we missed. Now, there's no need for us to go up here, but since we want all the loot, then we have to go up here. Uh -huh. Now I'm gonna save just in case. Jumping here will spawn two guys with a shotgun. Picking up this large med pack will spawn a guy with a bat. Over here we want to move this box to get some loot. This tile will spawn two dogs. Jumping over it can also spawn them. Now I'm gonna pull out my M16 and get rid of that guy because he's also guarding some loot. Jumping on this tile will spawn an eagle and a guy with a bat.
Now over here we will spawn two flamethrower guys and few rats. They are behind that fence and they can shoot through it. And just like that we can shoot them through it as well. Going this way will trigger a couple of barrel traps. Okay, one down. Another one down. Amazing. Now there is one more flamethrower guy that spawns. So I'm just going to wait for him here with my M16. He doesn't drop anything, these two don't drop anything. Now we need grenade launcher. Because there's a guy above us that we want to poof. There he is. From here, I like to equip the M16 and get rid of that guy. Then falling down here is the third and final secret of the level. Jumping on 
this tile spawns some eagles. Now, when we reach the bottom of the ladder, we want to jump backwards like this. Picking up this large med pack will spawn a couple of rats. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a like, dislike if you think it sucked, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.